GoPro Yano! First game review in 2021 is between Boon Min Jong and Park Jong Hwan. Park Jong Hwan is so famous. He's number two player in Korea. Everybody knows that he plays so well, he's so strong. But who is Moon Min Jong? Moon Min Jong is 3P and he's number 96. But Moon Min Jong astonished the world by beating Park Jong Hwan, number two player in Korea. Wow. Actually, Moon Min Jong is a very promising young player. He's only 17 years old. Nobody knew about him last year. But last year, Moon Min Jong became a champion in Globis Cup. Globis Cup is for young professional players and he just joined for the first time and he just became a champion. He beat many strong Korean and Chinese uh, professional players and became a winner. So his rank was jumped up to 96. So actually Moon Min Jong is like a rising star. And he hit the jackpot in this game. This game was played in 3rd of January 2021 in Korean Badug League. Let's see how number 96 player beat number 2 player. Moon Min Jong 3P is black and Park Jong Hwan 9P is white. Komi is 6.5 point and time limit is 1 hour each player for each player and 60 second Byoyomi just one time. They played on Baduk TV studio. So Park Jong Hwan has, you know, he's very an experienced player. So I am sure he's not nervous, but Moon Min Jong he must be very nervous. Here is Baduk TV Studios is live. Many people are watching him. And also his opponent is just Park Jong Hwan. So he must be nervous. But he played very well. So this crazy Joseki, super complicated one. Park Jong Hwan cut and Moon Min Jong played like this. After that, here, if black wanna play simple and black can just connect here and white will go down, black cut, duck, white take, these three stones and it's gonna be a fighting like that. But Moon Min Jong say, I don't wanna play so simple. I wanna go for a complicated one because I am not scared of Park Jong Hwan. So he just hane and it becomes very complicated variation. So guys, be prepared to see this crazy variation. White made this tiger's mouth, and black made this tiger's mouth, white has to connect here. And black has a weak point over here, so black has to play here, but before that, Atari first, because it's sente. After that, keep this uh, weak point, and white has to save that one. So it's like a caption race, this group versus this group. So who is gonna die? Nobody is gonna die if you don't make a mistake. So black increase black's liberty. So white has a weak point here. So after cut, white made this tiger's mouth. Black tried to kill. And white has to go down. Black filling out white's liberty. After that, white also play like that. And black connects here, try to kill this group. But white say, I can come in here. And white go down and go down. So what is that thing? So if white play here, black come in here, it's Seki. Dual life for both. So they are both alive. This variation, you don't have to remember. You don't have to memorize if you are below five done. Yeah, even for 5 down, it's so difficult to memorize. So everything, if you're not so confident about everything, you just play, you just play. Don't play that one, then you just play, duck, 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 and it's simple. All right, but they played such a complicated one. For professional players like them, they already studied so much about this variation. They have played a lot and also they know well about this variation. So both of them, they could play. Black played here as white to capture and you know, it's a seki, but white, Park Jong Hwan, don't care about that. Okay, Moon Min Jong, you just take my stone 
and after that I'm gonna take outside I think this is better for white which is true AI says mm, white has higher winning percentage so Moon Min Jong didn't like to capture that one and cut here and I'm gonna do a fighting against you so if white doesn't play here black is gonna attack here first then white is gonna die if white play here it's seki yeah because nobody can come in there and Park Jong-an played this move because Park Jong-an think after that uh, he wanted to save that he thinks this is big but actually AI say you should just give up like that and capture here so focus on the center was a little better but Park Jong-an just couldn't sacrifice that one and yeah oh this one scary one aiming to come in there so why the target here after that wow wow this is oh crazy fighting okay this is and that black has to save that and if white plays here it's me i a and b but the problem is if black plays here white die first so white has to save that one increase white's liberty and yeah since black has a weak point here black has to capture after that white come out like that okay protected white's weak point so it becomes a center fighting and let's guess Moon Min Jong's next move A or B Moon Min Jong as you see his style is pretty tight 12% differences between A and B so which is better A this move it seems like a drunken move drunken move and B seems more powerful but when white blocks here it may not be faster than A unless after you push white block unless you can honey here so that's the thing that's the thing so where is Moomin Jong's move? Moomin Jong's move is drunken boy this boy is so drunken so he's running away like that which is 42% winning rate and B is 54% winning rate so yeah you got Moo Min Jong's move, but that's not the best move, <laughs> sadly. So why black should play here? I guess Moon Min Jong is worried about when white plays here, if black has to play here, this tiger's mouth is pretty good. But the thing is, when white plays at two, black can just run away like that. Because why can I capture this one black stone? If just blow like that, and this is leather. So black can just run away. Yeah, so this was more powerful way to uh, go out towards the center. But Moon Min Jong played this drunken move after that. Yeah, here this is a leaning strategy. If answer it, you will be in danger. So Moon Min Jong was scared, so he just answered there. And Park Jong Un took this corner. It's not yet that. Yeah, always black can leave like that. But now that's small. So after that, yeah. Black tried to attack this group like this, after that, like that. Now, now is important because Park jong Hwan just captured like that and the corner, everything is that. Yeah, it looks big, but actually there was bigger one, which is ah, why it has to save this center part because that's not only big, but also Black's group is not alive. So gotta run away together, together. Yeah, those are quite uh, keystones for both. So this was small. And here Moon Min Jong also has to capture like that. This is pretty big, pretty, pretty big, very big. But both of them, they don't care about here. And he just took the corner. So now, white has to save that one, but both of them, they don't care, and Park Jong-un just invaded this side. Moon Min Jong jumped, Park Jong-un made this extension. After that, yeah, white tried to leave, and then, yeah, okay, white is alive. After that, yeah, black approached here. 
So here, yeah, this is uh, Keystones and not sure why they don't care. Mm, yeah, they think other places are bigger. Park jong invaded this corner after that black answer there. So why could actually move this corner? But Park jong was worried about this group, so he just protected mm, like this. So generally, Park jong move seems... Mm, very thick in a good way, but bad in a bad way is a little slow. So here, now, if black plays there, black is winning. Like, okay, here and take this group. And now black is about 67 winning rate percent. And that means about 2 and 6 points black is winning. Yeah. But... They don't care about this center and who this move means okay if you answer like that as you see my lower side and the center is going to be so great which is true which is true so here again Park jong has to save that stones I guess Park jong judgment uh, was a little wrong so he just didn't care about that one and he just focused on just breaking black's moyo. Yeah. Here, Moon Mi Jung also has to capture like that and black has 82% winning rate. It's about 6 points ahead. Black is ahead, but Moon Mi Jung just captured the corner for sure. And after push, next move is Park Jong Han's losing move. Park jong losing move is coming soon. Yeah, still, still, white has to try like this. For example, like if black attaches here, after that, this black group is not alive yet too. So black, oh, so, so Park jong has to try. This is Park jong last chance. But Park jong just very gently, softly jumped here. Hey boy, you just take my stones because even if you kill everything, that's not gonna be enough for you. Which wasn't true, sadly. So after that, Park jong took this corner and even though this is Sente, yeah. Mm. After that, the corner, the center was too big. So they played actually till the end. But after that, Park jong didn't have a chance. To win so at the end they counted and Moon Min Jong won by one and a half point wow Moon Min Jong must be very happy to beat number two player Park Jong Hwan so I wanted to show you this game how 96 player beat number two player yeah so I think the content of the move uh, of Moon Min Jong was quite good mm, quite good even though he made a little mistake but generally, I think it was a great game. So review is done. Thank you for watching this video. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye. Annyeong. Ciao.